so to set up the digital miner it is very simple you need to put it down as soon as you put it down you need some kind of electricity for this to work in this case i've got a creative energy cube you may not have this in the survival world so just you need to basically put your own energy wherever it might be i'm going to place it as soon as you place it it should work if it doesn't come to your creative energy cube and make sure that you have all the outputs set to eject on and obviously the side right come to digital miner reset it i do recommend resetting it now come to configuration and from here what you need to do is you need to edit your settings for the radius you want to obviously put as big radius as you want because the bigger the radius the more resources so i recommend this changing to this to 32 if i'm not wrong 32 is the highest yep 32 is the highest minimum just leave this to zero and maximum um you can i like to change this to 100 so just change it to 100 if you want to right now the filters the filters you need to put the resources that you want to mine in this case we're going to select or diamond right or diamond ore now i'm going to put or diamond and you're going to ask how do i know that this is called or diamond if you have this i don't know what this mode is called i think it's called world ui or something it is just a mod i don't know what's it called sorry right if you put for example diamond ore right and remember that you need to put ore right it cannot be diamond if you come to diamond ore and you press left shift it tells you right at the bottom it says ore diamond so what you need to do is for the the ore you're trying to mine uh, what you need to put it on right so press make sure you press save because it's not going to save otherwise okay now let's actually figure out for example redstone right so or redstone right you get the idea right save now if you just press escape or you press the arrow that was there you have options now i don't really recommend these options i don't really use them at all they're useless um if you want then silk touch is your way to go for example if you want to get diamonds and you want to multiply then take silk touch however beware that it takes a lot of electricity before you start there's also upgrades but you need to really really be prepared for this because this can be expensive the upgrades are as follows anchor speed and energy right these are the free upgrades that you can take and you're free to install install them if you wish now as soon as you press start it's gonna mine so as you can see there's redstone and in a second we should get some diamonds right i'm just actually gonna install show you how to install this so if you take the speed upgrades i've got eight of them eight is the maximum so i'm just gonna throw them in and they should start working now additionally if you don't have electricity what you can use is you can use a wind generator you can use elite sorry the advanced solar generator however i think the wind generator is the best because the solar panels don't really create any energy during the night as you can see however the wind generator in fact does as you can see it's getting charged and it is creating energy 24 7 whereas the 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 solar generator really doesn't create anything okay going back to the digital miner as you can see it is very fast with the eight upgrades that i have as you can see it's going very very fast and you're getting a lot of redstone and diamonds right if you press self touch i might actually crash it because it has yeah so basically the self touch as you can see it is going to create problems because it is the basically energy required is too much right so now if you want to basically reset the whole machine which if you want to basically like if i stop as you can see i can't modify this to modify it again you need to press reset it actually doesn't do anything it just resets the state of it and that's it so if you want to configure it just click here and boom you can put new filters and stuff okay i hope you enjoyed don't forget to leave a like subscribe comment if you want to see any specific mod leave me a comment down below and i'll try to make a tutorial about it thank you for watching peace